we are told that the Court of Appeal has lifted the orders suspending implementation of the Infamous Finance Act. And they say pending determination of the main suit. What that means is Kenyans are now going to be even more heavily taxed. Is there not a cause? So, statement by Zumiya Laumoja, one Kenya at the interdenominational Eureka Mass, July the 28th, 2023. Dear Kenyans, Isaiah 4031 says, and I want to quote, but they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings like eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. Kenyans, we are here to renew our strength. Even as we say Kwaheri to these wonderful Kenyans who are not here with us. Yes, fellow Kenyans, after the beatings and murders of these past days, past days, we have to renew our strength. We must mount up with wings because we do wait upon the Lord. We are here to stand with the families of those we've lost and to stand with all who call them friends. The people we lost in these protests did not have to die. Those who are hurt did not have to suffer that fate. All that they were asking for was for the Kenya Kwanzaa regime to drop the harsh taxes and lower the cost of best. I also want to acknowledge the contribution of a brother, Raila Molo Odinga, of one million shillings. And I'm escorting them with a half a million shillings. Ah, wonderful. Members of parliament have already given 1.5 million shillings. We further take this opportunity to thank all our citizens who continue to append their signatures to signal the withdrawal of support for the Kenya Kwanzaa regime. As we speak, the signatures as of today stand at 8.2 million. And we are still counting. Please continue signing. I should be very bold. Courageous. Bold and courageous. Be of good courage. And stand very strong. Those are the words that Moses gave, I think, uh, to, to Joshua. Be strong and of good courage. I also want to announce on our behalf that on Sunday the 30th of July, that is day after tomorrow, we shall communicate to the nation our next course of action with regard to anti-tax protests. May God bless and keep those we have lost in eternal peace, young as they were. 